Hi boys and girls, it's Mrs. K, and I'm gonna do another lesson this week on subtraction using the base 10 blocks. Last week I talked to you about using the base 10 blocks for questions that didn't require any regrouping. So this week we're gonna do the same technique, but we're gonna work on some regrouping questions. So I'm gonna do it first with the base 10 blocks, and then we're gonna do it as a picture, which is how you'll do it at home. So we're gonna start with 63, subtract 28 is our question. We're gonna build 63. So I'm gonna start with my base 10 blocks, my rods, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 61, 62, 63. So I have my start number. Now I'm gonna subtract 28. So I always start with my ones. I wanna take away eight ones. I only have three ones, so I actually can't do it. This is where regrouping comes in. I need more ones so I can take eight away. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my rod, I'm gonna trade it in for 10 ones. So one rod comes out and I replace it with 10 more units. Two, four, six, eight, 10. So same thing, I just traded it out, I took this guy out and added those in. Now I have enough to take away my eight ones. So I'll subtract two, four, six, eight, and then we take away two tens, and I'm left with my answer. 10, 20, 30, 33, 34, 35. So if we did that as a picture, we'd start with 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 61, 62, 63. I can't take away my eight ones, so I'm going to Cross that guy out and replace him with 10 ones. Then I'm gonna go ahead, take away eight. So I'm gonna take away five and those three, that makes eight, cross them out. Then I'm gonna take away two rods, so cross these guys out. And then I can add, um, count out my answer. 10, 20, 30, 35, same answer. So again, when you're drawing your picture, you, if you don't have enough ones, cross out a rod, replace it with 10 ones, and then go ahead and start. Good luck.